Hey guys, look at my garden. It looks like a jungle here. Let me start from the front. That means I need to clean clean up. Yeah, I've been winning here for almost a week. Non stop. So see if I can I need to take some of this out here and here too. Now we're going to the back of the garden itself. I'm not sure what this is, but I tell you, the thing sees itself every year. My neighbor gave me uh, some seeds uh, 60 years ago. Okay, put it up out. You take, if you take this seed right now and just throw it in the ground and leave it there and do nothing, it will still uh, uh, bloom in the spring in this flower. Look at this. Maybe I need to make the uh, garden tool for today. You know what? Let, let's do that now. So look at the, the roses here. And you guys know I had a stroke, so I, I'm talking a lot better now. And thank you again for, for being with me all this time. And I tell you, my talking is a lot better than a few months ago i'm so glad guys good okay so now look at my cannon here see look at that nice flower in here it's a rose of shower so nice remember when i planted this tree now look look at it now do hot tall her garden. So I need to trim it. Look at the beautiful flower in the garden. Look at this. Look at this one. Nice. And also the rose are showering too in the back. And look look how it's it looks like a forest, I tell you. That means I had to do a lot of work because the growth to maintain the, the, this area. At the bottom, you see my rabbit, Petunia, in here. You gotta remember, this is a orange moss I planted around the dead stump. And this, this uh, moss is very nice. You can even walk on this. I but decided to pull it pull it around the uh dead stump of the uh, tree that had died. I thought the moss around here would be nice and I put a pot on it. Here you have a hydrangea. You you saw it come large and white. It's turning pink now. M ear lady of the valley this too come by every year this is palm my children my children have created for me i have a video on that look at the turtle in my palm looking at you. can you see it she's looking right there at you i think you can see her looking see more around She coming? She coming up? Let me see if I give. If I give her to come up. She not coming. So, remember when I cleaned the area here? Almost a month ago. And look at the, the growth around here. The shrub grows. I put in the pot. They bloom in red. The fountain tree I planted in the spring it's going to bloom in white and excuse my uh my the appearance of my garden like I told you I need to do to clean it up my children went back to college so I will I will go on for about 
almost two to three weeks and the garden has not been taken care of since three weeks ago almost uh, a month so now i am back i'm going to take care of the garden now casa dogwood tree they too it go uh, bloom in the spring in white flower this is my plum tree and in the back you see uh fire hydrangea you see this flower used to come uh, in white now it turning pink pink now it's very nice in uh in a race in the summer you saw me cut, cut this flower back and put it in uh my flower arrangement it's the same uh flower uh the tree i cut my flower from it was white at that time now it's pink very nice cannon in yellow I put them in, in the part there too here. We are entering the uh, coat yard of the garden. Look at this flower, very nice. Look at that. And I tell you, my garden, I had no chemical in here, except for fatal lasso I used to use. Cosmoco I put in my soil when I'm planting something. But except for that, there's no chemical in here. Why do I usually amend my, my own soil? Look at the nice rose. It smells so good. Calf California Trivet uh, tree I planted. Then come back and go in the yard yeah, of the garden now. Here you can see has some tomato in the pot. And this a uh, you when you buy a uh, plant from your nursery in this last pot, I used to keep the, the pot and put some soil in here and planted my tomato in here. And you can see some of the tomato, tomato here a lot. I think they can be done tonight. I'm going to pick it and take it in the house. Did you guys remember when I planted? The tree in the trust trust can. It's a shower. Look at that bloom. On the plant, it's a lamb ear and some hosta pepper. I planted from seed. And here you see some marigold seedling. I planted, but I did want maybe two. I put in this box here. You can you can you cannot even see the box itself because so much growth. It's a vine. So in the back, cannon again in red, dark red. Let me tell you about the the hosta. One of my neighbor was selling their house and they had dug up all the hot stuff from their front yard. And one of my neighbor was, um, you know, just exercising. She called me and both of us went and got some hot stuff from them. But I, I got so much, and my son at that time was here before he went back to college. So we went and took our car and got some, and they told me to come back to get more. I did. And at that time, when I got there, there was so much hassle. I said I cannot fit it in my car. They also they offer to load all the hosta 
in that truck and deliver it to my home. And about two mini drafts, so they did. And they unloaded all the hassle. My Lord, I told, I said to my son, how in the world am I could able to fit all the hassle in their garden? But I did. You can see it's, I have more hassle. There's some of the hassle I get to divide it around. You see, there's some here too. Look how large they are. They got, they got everything has to, look at this. Yeah, I, I put some in the pot here. I put some here. I put some around here. And some around here. I put more around here. And here, I doing some work here. So you can see, I'm trying to mix the area here. Like a greenhouse area here, right here. It's small, but this way I can hold my tent up plants that will not survive winter so i can build something around here and pull you up my my plants here so i put some some hats in here i put some here i just put them all around the garden wherever i could i'm so glad so you can see you can see why i told you it, it would take me about two to three days to take care of the garden because it's it has overgrown no marigold on the plant my Asian pear I see more tomato I need to harvest too so also I can take you upstairs remember this vegetable planter I made and planted all the uh, herbs and vegetables. You see some pepper in the back. Chili pepper, pepper. See, I see a lot of pepper all the way around. Basil, so. eggplant. We have over two serving a dinner from the uh, airplane. Put pepper in here. Rose mirror in here. See more bell pepper. This is lemon grass. Lemon grass. Let me tell you about the lemon grass. Lemon grass is very good in tea. Some people cook for them. We usually make tea from it. We get cut it, wash it up, and and put it in and boil it and use it liquid for for tea. Look at see. Let's go back down. I have so much work ahead. But for me, this is good because I love to work in my garden. I forgot, I forgot to show you the, the hot drink. Okay. okay, guys. So far, I have done this much. I uh, cleaned some air of the garden. And uh, so I'm going to rake, rake all, everything up and put it in the uh, in the bed here I will come back again and finish the rest of the uh, the garden I'll talk to you soon then